talk briefly about Michelle O'Connell's case, St. Augustine, Florida. Another case of injustice. Young lady with a child, boyfriend to deputy sheriff of St. John's County. According to him, she took a service revolver while he was, or his service weapon, I should say, while he was in the garage or some other place not nearby her. Shot herself in the face. Surrounding area, neighbors said they heard someone scream, heard a gunshot, another scream, and then another gunshot. Interesting. When uh, police arrived, St. John's County Sheriff, they allowed him to remain on the scene in the room where he pointed out evidence. Interesting enough why he wasn't expelled from the scene immediately. Uh, subsequently, St. John's County cleared the case of suicide even though the medical examiner in that district, as well as the FDLE, believe it or not, actually call it a homicide because of experts that uh, were involved in the case that inspected the firearm and determined that uh, it was not a self-inflicted wound. But as we sit here today, uh, Governor Scott apparently has signed a petition just before his re-election campaign and uh, now elected again for a second term. Let's see if uh, his appointed state attorney actually does the job he should be doing or if it's going to be just another cover-up.